taken to golf. A lot of these look lost. They broke. They think it's my fault. No call. I want that call. I'm dripping. I'm stuck with the sauce. Good drip. But she love you. Don't cut your... Yeah, yeah, Reynolds of Vinci yeah, is white. Yeah, yeah. Limited Louis that's light. Yeah. Rape in the city that's light. Yeah. LED, look at the lights. Yeah. We the ones that don't like. Don't like but you look too light. Yeah. Why even play with your life? Yeah. Bank account looking like yikes. Uh, yeah. yeah. With, with me, me, boy. Keep your hands in your fingers. Keep your ears with a Get back, watch it turn to a singer. Get you fighting like the Jerry Springer. All of my... Zip the back, they like a popo. Boom, boom. No, do these, they popo. Had a G-Wagon truck turned to Rojo. Find a cable to us and they come and ride down to Soho. One's black and the other was Mexican. You had a like a polo. Younger than you with a Maybach. Younger than you with a Bentley. Finna pick up in the gently. Angry and friends with these. Cause when I was down, I'd have so had sympathy. But that's how I go when you broke. Now I'm not like Mr. Toe. This do my own. Not gonna lost on these new clones. Then she asked for a loan. Had the laugh, then I told her get gone. Go and get the on your own. And up, give me not a thing. So I spend 90k on my reign. You can see all my pain in my watch. Got my ex down and walk around with my hand on my. Cause I'm popping and I know you're not. And I know you see just how I'm living. You're not happy with life, so you. Rockin' Reeboks on treetops, getting walk. Got a big band, it's like Sasquatch. Every time you see it, what a. No, it's talking about. I got that chicken to go. A lot of these look lost. They broke, they think it's my fault. No call. I want that call. I'm dripping. I'm stuck with the sauce. Good drip. But she love you. Don't cut your. Yeah, yeah, Reynolds of Vinci yeah, is white. Yeah, light. Limited Louis that's light. Yeah. Rape in the city that's light. Yeah. LED look at the lights. Yeah. We the ones that don't like. Don't like us. But you look too light. Yeah. Why even play with your life? Yeah. Bank account looking like yikes. Yeah. Yeah. I told IG all the time. Yeah. I did not go lie. Yeah. Waggle steak. I died. Yeah. Eight ounce two fifty five. Yeah. I can't get fuck you with. To groovy you me. If I had love for me, I would have tried to get Nicki Minaj. Jerry ain't gonna let you slide. Dory ain't gonna let you slide. You king of the city. I don't wanna be a big fish in a small pond. Trying to get across that water. I need fans in Vietnam. If you gotta hustle, but you can't stick to the ground, you wasting your time. I need a double of verse. I do it for it. FaceTime before I get to the club. Look at the line. Money ain't changed my heart, but I'm smarter. I guess it changed my mind. And I take care of my in prison. Don't think it's safe inside. I got that chicken to go. A lot of these look lost. They broke. They think it's my fault. Welcome in, everybody. It's all right. Thanks, coach. EA Sports coverage of the National Football League is on the air. Today, we've got an NFC South matchup between the New Orleans Saints and the Atlanta Falcons. Here's Bosher to kick it away. This will be taken to the back of the end zone. And no run back here. This will be a touchback, and it comes out to the 25-yard line. First carry now, this is Alvin Kamara. And he is met quickly in the backfield. Down he goes, folded like a lawn chair. Nice play right there to stop him behind the line, but I want to see how this defense continues to play him here in the first half. Yeah, we know, you know better than I. He has the ability to take over a game, so what do you do? Yeah, I think you have to make sure that you bottle him in at varying levels. Because if you crowd everyone to the line of scrimmage, if he breaks through, it's nothing but room to run. Sometimes the coverage is so good, no matter what you're doing on offense, you just can't shake anyone free. They try their best to find someone open, but they took away every passing alley, every angle, and shut the play down. Pressure brought in, and the Falcons get there for the sack. Tack McKinley coming in to drop him for a loss of eight, and it'll be fourth down. Great job defensively. I think he was trying to go through his progressions, find someone to get rid of the football. Before he knew it, he was on his back. So that just brings us right back to what you said in the beginning. A great job defensively. Nowhere to go with the football. That led to the sack. And now running right through it. Touchdown, Falcons! Justin Hardy, 71 yards. And the Falcons have taken the early. They get the stop defensively, force the punt. They score without their offense even stepping on the field. I remember playing 
and playing on special teams and teasing the guys out of offense. I love you know, don't even worry about it. You guys just hang out over there. We'll bring this one all the way back and get the points we need. In this case, they actually got that done. So after the punt return touchdown, let's see what their opponents can do with this kickoff. Back out onto the field now comes the New Orleans offense. And their second attempt here, the first drive, stalled and they punted. Time to break some things out, I think, in the playbook. Now that they've got it. And oh, right away, he lost the football. But fortunately, the Saints were able to hold on to it, so they will indeed keep possession. Wow, that ball gets knocked free, but a teammate comes along and scoops it up. Almost like, it's almost like baseball. Guys at bat, people are on base in scoring position. One guy doesn't get them home. The next guy comes through and picks him up. And avoids the turnover. And brought down, but not before reaching the 45-yard line. They got 18 yards out of that one, and it gets them a new set of downs. Now that tight end position, it just seems to continue to evolve every year in the NFL. Yeah, you're getting really terrific athletes. A lot of them maybe were wide receivers at one point. They continue to give you speed, great hands, and big bodies, which make them excellent targets for quarterbacks. And here now, the defensive starters for Atlanta. There's a lot to like about Robert Alford's play. Tenacious, tough, gritty, able to run. The one thing he's trying to clean up, gets a little handsy at times with the receivers. Sometimes he'll work out with boxing gloves in practice to remind himself to keep his hands off of those guys so he can just go ahead and make plays. teammate of mine. We used to call him the trash man. His ability to sift through traffic and make plays was uncanny. And that's exactly what you want from your Mike linebacker. To throw, it's Breeze. And this is going to be incomplete. It's a great job by this secondary. When I watch them, they remind me of elite defenders on a basketball court, right? They want to contest each and every pass. Great contest on third down to bring up fourth. And great special teams work here. This is knocking on the door of the five. They'll spot it at the six-yard line. On first down, Ryan. He completes it to Jones. Oh, and now he pulls him over. And he's taken down, but not before reaching the 20. First down yardage on the first play of the drive, giving 14. I know that's their first connection in this game, but you and I both know that Julio Jones is without a doubt his quarterback's favorite target. Oh, yeah, Matt Ryan loves this guy. And who would? Yeah, and the reason that he's that is because of his dependability. And quarterbacks have to have that from their receivers, meaning... They know where they're going to be when they're running certain routes. They don't break them on them. They don't change them up and do their own freelance stuff and put their quarterbacks in bad situations. Matt Ryan has ultimate trust in Julio Jones. Two plays, two catches. You have a feeling they're going to look for him early and often, and that's to be expected. you got a player of his caliber. Why not? And I think it's also a message from them to the defense that you're not going to dictate to us what we're going to do with one of our better players because... So often you hear about defenses saying, we'll take away what you do best. In this case, they're going to move him around, find proper matchups, and make sure they continue to funnel the ball to him. Chances are good. He's going to be a very busy guy. Two catches already in this opening drive, and they were looking his way for a third. I think they put this defense on notice that that could be a really, really frequent combination. Forced out to his left. And nearly an interception here on their opening drive. But instead, third down. We'll put a check mark in the box where the defense coordinator was saying, how well can we stay with these receivers if we're in man coverage? Because he just did it on that one. Force the incompletion. That allowed him to get bolder with his pass rush, won't it? Absolutely. Freeze up your guys elsewhere. To throw is Ryan. 
He can run for it, and he will. And he will avoid the contact as he slides to a stop. The scramble good for a nice gain of 10 yards, but still fourth down. I liked his effort there. He got it done on his own, but let's face it. He puts defenses in a really stressful spot when he takes off and runs because a lot of guys have coverage responsibilities. Good job of rallying, though, because I thought when he first took off, he might pick up the first down. Now Ryan. He'll rifle this. It's caught inside the 25. Touchdown, Falcons. Julio Jones, 57 yards. And the Falcons will extend their lead. Wow, talk about a big fourth down conversion for the score defensively. How do you let that happen? Yeah, I think you start with the offense and you give them credit for going for it, having that type of, well, let's face it, audacity. But defensively, I think you're right on target, partner. There's no way something like that's supposed to happen in that situation. You're supposed to be able to shut that down and get the ball back for... Oh, they flip it to the kicker. He looks like he's going to throw it. That's going to be caught at the 10-yard line. And he'll get it here to the 10-yard line. Uh, let me go ahead and show my age a little bit. I liked it when they would fake it from the three-yard line, right? When you'd line up, go ahead, and oh, there's a fake. And oh, he's going to get two. That's great. But from the 15... The risk-reward, it's just not there. It's so risky to get 15 yards on a fake. Well, you see the result right there. Yeah, I know these young whippersnappers are trying to do different things in this game, but let's go back to old reliable. Kick the ball through the post. Get off my lawn. That's darn right. Short, short kick. One of the up middle take it now. And they're going to start this drive in pretty good shape as they get it up past the 30. So Bree's going to lead the Saints up here, first and 10 at the 34. Hey, yellow lady. Reset. Reset. They start the drive on the ground. Kamara. They'll get about four as he's past the 35 to the 38 yard line. At the end of one, plenty of scoring here already. EA Sports NFL Sunday returns following this. With Charles Davis, I'm Brandon Gordon. It's Saints football to begin quarter number two. They've got it second and six to start things out.
Shotgun now for Breeze. Throwing over the middle, and it's incomplete. Cameron Meredith, the intended target. Third down here. Well, they're slinging it. And then there's one you got to put a timer on, huh? I mean, that one came in hot. That came in hot, but overthrown out of his reach and incomplete. Breeze now to throw. And that is incomplete. A third down, he tried to stay in bounds, did all he could. He caught it, but was led a little bit too far. Yeah, and that's always difficult, isn't it? Because you know half of your body is trying to stay behind while the other half is reaching out, trying to catch the football. The top half worked. It was the bottom half that was in question. 12 yards on the return that time. And the offense will take over with a new set of downs. Getting set to go again on offense. First and ten, Ryan flushed out right on the run. He'll let this go deep right side. Oh, that was dangerous. Threw it into coverage, almost picked, but instead they'll keep it on second down. You're down two touchdowns. You just know defensively you absolutely have to come up with a big play. That nearly was one right there. Looked over at the sideline immediately after the drop and just saw the dejection. They felt it. They thought he had it. Unfortunately, couldn't come up with it. And able to get this one across the 45 before he's brought down. Ryan to Jones, the Falcon connection there for a first. First down, Ryan flush to his right. On the run, he'll let this go. This is caught inside the 15. And he takes it all the way down to the three. A big play there, Ryan to Jones. 49 yards. A nice job there, Charles. They picked up the blitz, were able to complete the pass. That had the total feel of a quarterback in control. Red blitz, got him into the right protection scheme. So he doesn't get hit back there. He's got a chance to step up with supreme confidence and deliver it downfield for a nice completion. It's a loss of eight there on the first down play. So they get pushed back to the 11, and here's second and goal. Four down, four down. Ryan. And he can't corral it. Maybe a big missed opportunity there defensively in the end zone. And now third down. Now we've got third and goal coming up, and couldn't you imagine being in that huddle, partner? You know they're looking at each other saying, we can't come away with just three points after this drive. Yeah, they've covered a lot of ground. They want more than that three. On third and goal, Ryan buying time to his left. And almost intercepted. Would have been a huge pick in the end zone, but as it stands, that brings up fourth. Terrific coverage in the end zone that time. Forced him out of the pocket to his right. I thought maybe try and run it there, but no one came open for him. Nice job by the defense of not getting out of their lanes. Fourth down. Here's Ryan. Now he's got it. And he is into the end zone for a Falcon touchdown. Julio Jones. With a little over two minutes to play in the second quarter, the offense gets ready to take over. Now Ryan on first down. Escaping the pressure right. Looking deep for Julio. And that's going to wind up incomplete. However, we do have a flag down. Let's check in with our referee. Offense. So this will be accepted as it moves the offense backwards. Two minutes to play in the second quarter. The offense gets ready to take over. So the illegal forward pass also costs him a down. And now it's second and long. Here's Ryan. 
eluding the pressure right. And they'll bring him down at the 27-yard line. Give him seven there on the tuck and run, and they're in better shape now for third. Two minutes remain here in the first half. We're back to Atlanta right after this timeout. A reminder that when halftime rolls around, Jonathan Coachman will have all the highlights and analysis of this first half of play from our studios in Orlando. Now Ryan flushed out right, and it's knocked away and incomplete. Marshawn Lattimore right there on the coverage. He was draped all over it. Well, the obvious goal is to try and score a touchdown, but at the least, adding to a pretty big yardage total for his intended receiver there, huh? Yeah, well, when you've got a guy over 150 yards, <laughs> keep chucking it deep to him, I guess. Yeah, no doubt about it. You can get it to him short, and he can make plays that way, but I like what you get. He's got a man complete! And he'll have it past midfield almost to the 40 before being taken down. Fourth down conversion plays, you usually think one, two, three yards, maybe ten. Not there. What a huge pickup as the sticks make. A drastic shift forward. On first and ten, it's Ryan. Flush to his right. Looking downfield for Jones. And lucky to get away with one there. That one nearly picked. Second down. He's lucky to be getting that one back. After what they've done with him all day long with all the targets trying to go after him, he's obviously gotten smart and his pride has kicked in. Made a terrific play. Ryan, escape, got a man, it's caught inside the 10. And they will eventually get him down, but he's inside the five all the way to the three. They give him a gain of 38. So the defense blitzed, a nice job picking that up, completing the pass. And how in sync was the quarterback in his center on that play? They saw the blitz made the appropriate calls, got the line engaged, because now they know there are going to be extra guys coming at the quarterback, so they got their assignments down pat and kept them away from him, and he's able to step up in the pocket and fire one now for a really good strike. Again, Ryan. And an incomplete pass. That'll stop the clock here with just under a minute to play in half number one. Feels like they're getting caught in between here because they didn't completions on first and second down. Now you got to worry a little bit about the clock because you prefer not to give them another shot here in the first half. But if you don't pick up the first down, guess what? You're likely going to... And he's got his star receiver. It's Jones for the Falcon touchdown. Matt Ryan now three first half touchdowns. Passes and a Falcon. This offense ready to get back out there as they'll have the football to start the third quarter. They go play action here on first down, eluding the pressure right. There's that man again, it's complete. And they nearly get this all the way to midfield. Mark him down at the 49. That one goes for 24 yards. His big game continues. Already has the three touchdown grabs, tacking on some more yardage in a first down. And how precise has his route running been in this game? We just saw him get open yet again. And he's also made adjustments as the defense has tried to really stop him. Get up! So one play, and they're already just shy of midfield. Now a play fake here on first down. Being chased out left. 
And a scary incompletion, almost picked off. It would have been their first INT of the game. Instead, second down. Oh, man, that was close. The opportunity to change momentum, big play, right in his hands, unable to come down with it. A sigh of relief, no doubt, on offense that that fell harmlessly to the ground. Second and ten, it's Ryan again. And despite the good footwork, he'll be hit and dropped shy of the 45. He'll wind up getting four there on his own, but it will leave him now with a third down situation. The Falcons on third down. They've only converted once in four tries. This will be third and six. Now it's Ryan. Flushed out right. Now he's going to throw deep right side. And he can't quite pick it. No interception so far. That probably should have been their first. But at least it's fourth down. Even though that one was incomplete, you could see the training that went into that play. He gets out of the pocket. Ends up. to his right. All he's trying to do, though, extend the life of the play. Keep it alive, hoping someone will pop free. Was able to take a pretty good shot with a deep ball, but incomplete. Flush to his right. And my goodness, this is incomplete. Marshawn Lattimore right there on the coverage. He was... This offense will get another shot at it as so they'll quickly head back onto the field. And now before this first down play, we're going to get a timeout here. It's just their first, so two remaining as they burn one here in this third quarter. Now following the interception, this offense will get another shot at it as they'll quickly head back onto the field. the interception. Here's Ryan escaping the punt. It's caught inside the 25. And he'll get this one down near the 20-yard line. Just shy of the 20. An excellent pickup of 34 yards. I think by now it's been demonstrated quite well in the NFL that mobility is an attribute. But when you couple it with accuracy, you've really got something going. Able to get outside the pocket and complete the pass. And he bats it away falls down incomplete. Marshawn Lattimore right there on the coverage. He was draped all over it. Boy, you will not see a quarterback of his caliber miss a one like that very often. I mean, there it is, wide open, got the shot, and he misfires. We talk about, boy, he'll want that one back all the time. He definitely wants that one back. Ryan dancing to his left. And he comes back with one complete. First target, first catch, and a first down. On any given pass play, you never know exactly where your exit points are going to be. On this play, he was flushed to his left, still on the run, able to accurately throw the football for a nice first down.
throw again. And he's got his star receiver. It's Jones. See the best of them Jando Money for the life And they can't stop Never met a man That they can't talk We're talking on the phones They can hear us When you got dumb cake Up in the Say that they be waiting for you In the bushes With the duct tape Up and down the interstate Yeah we really touch We touch October I'm about to Another skate